pipeline. Joseph Elliott Prune. All right, we're at the Muay Thai Ultimate with Chris Henry, who just came off this rematch with Robert Muse. How you feeling? Good. Tired. So, uh, from the first fight, what do you think you picked up from Robert that you brought into training this time around? Try to block leg kicks, but uh, a little bit faster. So uh, I was trying to clinch with him, and every time I clinch, he would hold. Or uh, not to say that I, you know, that he's playing it off, but those kicks were not to the balls. It was, I caught him, you know, mid leg, and it seems like every time I catch him with something, you know, oh, am I growing or whatever, but it is what it is. Um, he won the fight again, so congrats to Robert the Moose. Still a champion, great champion, good job. All right, cool. So, uh, what do you think went different this time around? Um, probably just the leg kicks. I mean, I mean, we're going head kick for head kick, you know, blow for blow. Um, I don't know, he's just a champion. I have to knock him out, you know, for me to win the fight. And he's, you know, defending champion. I gotta, I gotta knock him out, and it just didn't happen. So, so you had some awesome knees in this fight uh, this time around. Yeah. Uh, it's definitely a shock to see. Was that something that you picked up the last time? Did you yeah, kind of yeah, saw yeah. that opening? Um, there was a lot of knees that I caught him with last time that really, really hurt him. Um, so this, the game plan was, you know, block the kicks, which were a lot faster this time. Didn't hurt as much, but uh, but when I get a solid shot moving for a knee or a jump knee or you know a spinning back elbow or something, so yeah, it was a game plan. So how much of a difference did it make adding elbows into this fight? Uh, we had elbows last fight, but it was just you know spinning back elbows. It was um, outlawed last time. So, oh, they took yeah, this time the last time. Yeah. So I think this time I caught him with one. Kind of rocked him a little. I gotta watch the tape. But I know I caught him with one. So. Yeah, definitely. So what do you have coming up in the future for you? Um, I'm going to take a break from Muay Thai for a little bit. I'm going to go to dabble in MMA for a little bit, probably like one or two fights, and uh, we'll try it out, see how it goes. I'm going to take a break for a couple months. And, Any uh, particular promotion that you're looking at? Uh, I think Camo for my first one. It's going to be in Victorville, so it's close by. CFL? Then, yeah, yeah, CFL. And then uh, we'll probably go to King of the Cage. <laughs> so have you done any other uh, MMA fights before? Is this going to be no, your first this one? Gonna be my first one. So I'm, I've done Jiu Jitsu for a little bit, but i got to brush up on it and really dig in and work yeah. on this thing. So. Did you belt in Jiu Jitsu at all? She didn't win, but she just turned perfect down. All right. We're at the Muay Thai Ultimate with Chris Henry. You can check him out in August at the Combat Fight League when Chris goes from the ring to the cage.